calculating joint rotation in beams. This example is a part of a series of lectures on the slope deflection method. Here we want to establish a mathematical relationship between a member end moment and joint rotations in a beam segment. Consider a simply supported beam with a constant EI. Suppose the beam is subjected to a counterclockwise moment at the left end, causing the beam to deform like this. Let's refer to the counterclockwise rotation at A as theta A and call the clockwise rotation at B theta B. We wish to determine the mathematical relationship among MAB, theta A, and theta B. Put it differently, we want to compute theta A and theta B in terms of MAB. Let's use the virtual work method for calculating these joint rotations. To calculate theta A, we need to have two moment equations. Moment equation for the beam due to MAB and moment equation for the beam due to a virtual unit moment placed at A in the assumed direction of the rotation. Now we can calculate theta A using equation. So we have To calculate theta B, we need to have two moment equations. Moment equation for the beam due to MAB and moment equation for the beam due to a virtual unit moment placed at B in the assumed direction of the rotation. We have done this computation already. And here is moment equation due to a virtual unit moment at B. Now we can calculate theta B via integration. In summary, given a beam segment AB subjected to a counterclockwise moment at A, the end rotations are 